Hi, how are you today? Today we're going to paint a pumpkin. So I have a pumpkin here and I have made sure that it's all nice and clean. And then I have some paints. I have them in a little tray so that I can mix them up. I have some paint brushes and a tub of water and a pen where I'm gonna draw my face on my pumpkin. I have downloaded a picture of a pumpkin that I'm gonna copy. So you might wanna do the same. Find a picture of a pumpkin that's painted and, and print it out so that you can copy the face onto your pumpkin. First of all, I'm gonna find a nice side for my pumpkin and I think here looks really good. And I'm gonna draw the face on my pumpkin. So I'm gonna start with doing a nose in the middle and then I'm going to put some eyes and then I'm going to draw on the mouth On there and then a big smiley mouth and then I'm going to put some teeth in the middle so I've drawn my face on my pumpkin and now I'm going to start painting so first of all I'm going to put the things on that will need to dry so I'm going to paint the black of my eyes, and I have some black paint here. So you might need to mix it up with a little bit of water. And I'm going to draw the black of my eyes on my pumpkin. Like that. And then I'm going to do the other one on the other side. So when we draw on the black on, and then I have to leave it to dry. So I'm going to draw the black on the mouth too. And I'm going to add a little bit more water to my paint so that it... I want it too runny though because I don't want it to run off my pumpkin. So I have to make it a little bit firm. Like that. So there I have the mouth of my pumpkin. Next, I'm going to colour the nose. I'm going to colour the nose red. There we have my beginnings of my face. I'm going to give him two little round dots on the side for cheeks. 
little red glow to my pumpkin. Now I'm going to have to leave it to dry so that I can add the other colours. So I'll see you in a little while. Now my pumpkin's dried a little bit, I can add the other pieces to my face. So I'm going to make sure that my brush is clean because I'm going to use white next. So I'm going to take the white paint and I'm going to add a dot on his eye just here. And then I'm going to do one to the other side as well, just there. And then I'm going to paint white. I make it quite thick because the orange of the pumpkin dilutes the colour a little bit. Now I've finished painting my pumpkin. I hope you've enjoyed painting your pumpkin with me today. I'll see you next time.